I think I am missing India. I'm not missing most of the Indian people, but I'm missing India in general, Indian spirit, Indian land, and Indian values, Indian environment, Indian summer, Indian rain. I'm missing so many elements of India and it is so sad. Sometimes you feel like, let's go, we should go to India, but sometimes also when you are compelled by circumstances that you can't go back, that it is not the time that you should visit India because of so many reasons, financially, politically, socially, spiritually, internally, in terms of your soul wise and and in in and there are so many other reasons that you can't just visit it and it feels so sad it is heartbreaking and sadly it feels more sad to realize that there is no solution and one can just wait wait forever and that's it <laughs> you can't do anything you just have to wait but i am missing india those indian values the indian struggle as well it was amazing in india i met some people they taught me life lessons and those were some of the worst people who i ever met in a in my life but they were there to help me to you know differentiate between good people and bad people and I, I believe that until you meet bad people you will never you know uh, distinguish between good and bad how can you see bad when you have seen only good so there are people that you meet in your life who realize you the difference between good and evil and that difference the realization of that difference can significantly change your life because it can change your life forever that's what i believe